with this install today's hair is from one of my favorites this is Asteria hair I'm just gonna breeze through the packaging real quick so that you guys can know all the goodies that they put in their packaging um the little uh, black elastic headband that you guys saw me use to lay down the lace they provided that in the box I don't know what I just did with it that quick but that came in the packaging there is two pair of eyelashes in here first pair and then there is Another pair in there, there is a little yellow edge brush with the comb on it. I love getting these, I just be collecting them. I got like so many different colors of them now. There is a cute little scarf in there, two pack of wig caps, and then lastly their standard little drawstring bag that you can put your unit in because as you can see, this is how uh, my box arrives. So it's like all dented up and everything. So I won't be keeping this. So that's why I like to keep the drawstring bags that they provide to put my units in for when I'm not wearing them. Plus I find 
that I get quite a bit of use out of using those for like other things. That's all that came in the packaging. Hair got to me really quickly. I want to say that they shipped it through FedEx and it came within like three to four days. So that's not bad at all. And as far as the details of this wig, this is their deep wave texture. Now I did do a video on their water wave texture. It almost looks very, very similar. So if you guys haven't seen that video and you're looking for some curly hair, definitely check out that video. I'm going to link it down below or put it in the cards here somewhere. Um, so you guys can make a decision as to which one you prefer. They honestly both have really really nice curl patterns this one is a six by six hd lace uh closure wig i got it in 24 inches and the density on it is 180 but it is so much more fuller than that like this is just the hair that's in the front but i also have a little bit of hair left um in the back looks like on me it stops right around this area as you guys can see the ends of the hair are nice and full nice and curly they're not um too dry or anything sometimes i have that issue with curly hair and they need a little bit more moisture but the ends of this hair actually look really good also this is a standard cap size and their standard cap size for this particular wig is a medium cap size now i typically tend to need to get my wigs in a size small so when i first put the wig on initially of course it was a little bit big but the good thing about um you know pre-made wigs is that they do come with combs and adjustable straps in them so i just had to go ahead and tighten them and it fits great so in terms of this being a small head friendly wig yes you just have to adjust it and so with that being said this is definitely big head friendly else it comes in the typical natural black hair color you can dye it or bleach it of course I never really do that with curly hair i feel like i don't really have the patience to go through and do that just because you really have to make sure you get every strand but of course you can definitely do that with this hair um what else i think that's pretty much it as far as all the details i just always like to make sure i don't forget anything also as far as the lace size you couldn't get this wig in a five by five or a six by six you can get it both in hd lace for both options and you can also choose to get it in transparent lace so you have a little bit of flexibility there with one or the other as to what you want the shortest length that this wig comes in is 16 inches and the longest length that it comes in is 30 inches this hair is pretty low maintenance all i did was put water in like the slightest bit of mousse on it it didn't really need any mousse i know that when i wear the water wave wig i don't put nothing on it but water so that's optional if you want to go in and put like any type of styling products on the hair and this is what the lace is looking like their lace is absolutely flawless <laughs> So yeah, it was really easy to put this hair in a half up, half down style. Like I said, I really love the curl pattern. Hair is super full and all that good stuff. So of course, I could always wear it in the side part. I could part it down the middle. I can pretty much do uh, whatever the parting space allows, which is for, you know, quite a bit of options there. Any questions, you can let me know. If you have got this wig for yourself and you want to share your experience, you can go ahead and leave a comment down below as well. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.